the most important action to reduce carbon footprint anybody must do is to stop using for fossil fuels. Uh, Metza board has, to, has a detailed roadmap um, how we aim to get rid of the uh, fossil fuels in the energy production of our mills. In parallel to it, we are moving to fossil free sources for the electricity we buy. Secondly, uh, light weighting of paperboard is a very special action Metza board has been doing for de decades. It enables reduction of carbon footprint in comparison to other heavier uh, packaging materials. The reduction is a combination of impacts of using less resources, including energy for manufacturing the products, uh, transportation and packaging waste. A third new action uh, we are pursuing is the carbon footprint of the value chain. This is an area, area where the value chain companies uh, must cooperate. Uh, the biggest opportunities are in the raw materials we buy and in transportation. Uh, the biggest change in the mindset of our clients during the recent years is that generic targets uh, are not enough anymore. Today, the ambitious targets must be combined with realistic action programs. Uh, the programs must then be followed and reported. The third party evaluations and audits play an important role in validating that the progress is taking place. For this reason, MetaPort actively participates in reporting programs such as Carbon Disclosure Project CDP. Uh, for us to join this new study was self evident. We at MetaPort want to contribute to the transparent disclosure of sustainability performance of our industry. Working together with ProCarton and RISE is really important and in line with our objectives. We benefit greatly from the validation of our data by third party and from the results to which we can benchmark our own, own performance to. We at MetSupport have assessed our carbon footprint since 2006 and made complete LCA studies since 2016. We renew our assessments on an annual basis. This monitoring ability helps us to know our position in the packaging industry, what comes to our relative impact to various environmental impact categories, such as climate change. This work has in addition helped us to identify hotspots in our own value chain and thus guided our actions towards ever more sustainable paperboard.